what's good YouTube so I did put on my um little banner 10% vlogs right so they're not gonna be long at all so since I'm on the way to get my baby um, a little quick update both my kids are in school um, they're both doing amazing um, Carson goes a half a day and then he goes to therapy the rest of the day you guys do not know that's my second born he's artistic and then Grayson goes a full day and then he does karate and that's know. so anyways I just came on here to update y'all um, I am doing fine as you guys can see I'm on a different journey um, hence the podcast um, and I just came on here because I literally thought I would never ever 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 do anything to do with school in my life again some kind of way I um, actually in July I believe um, got put on my heart to be do something with tech right because my business wasn't going as I wanted it to um, and then I buckled down and wholeheartedly focused on my business and it's where I wanted to be visually mission wise um, 2023 I'm believing something huge for that um, and I'm you know like building something for that you know and also you know I'm believing for my podcast because God literally told me to speak and do that so I don't know if I'm supposed to be obviously I'm probably supposed to be wholeheartedly focused on my podcast um, but also he did also tell me to deal with um, tech so uh, literally on the spiral the other day I signed up <laughs> to do a certificate or whatever I'm not going to say what in because I just don't want no bad juju on it and um, so yesterday I actually signed up for it um, I've been doing okay with the tests or whatever. I just have to buckle down and like really, really, really focus. I think it's the negativity of me saying like I would never ever go back to school. Um, I have my test um, that I'm going to do later on once I restudy a few more things. And um, basically I finished um, chapter one within a day. Um, I finished chapter one actually today. And like I said, I have to take my test. Um, it's just like a 20 minute quick test just to see like, you know, what I learned from the first chapter. It's like eight modules in each chapter. Like I said, I finished it in the end of the day. Um, the actual course is supposed to take like four months. I'm not gonna lie, y'all. I'll be finished with this within a week or two. That's just me. Um, and um, yeah, so I'm actually focused on that and then I have to focus on a bigger test later on and I'm like freaking excited about this because I really really um like getting a um going back into the world of something I love to do um why God build build my business and build me to where I need to be is amazing. And I feel like the reason why I need to go back is for a bigger picture. So I don't know. I'm just trying to be led by God. And if this ain't it, it don't even freaking matter. I'm gonna do it anyway. And I'm praying along the way. Um, I feel really good about where I'm at. Um, I haven't felt like, oh, like I'm wasting my time. Let me just go ahead and freaking stop this situation right now. Um, I feel really good. I feel really excited about it. I feel positive about it. And I'm ready because actually I was like wholeheartedly fully in. I got an interview like, oh my God. And the crazy part is like, I been trying to get interviews like so long I was just like I didn't even believe it was possible for real for real I got an interview it was some of obviously amazing people um that interviewed with me um somebody else got the job I wasn't mad about it I was pretty much hurt about it but I wasn't discouraged because at that point I'm just like I got something bigger for me and that's just like what I'm on right now like I can't be discouraged by things that's not for me, period. Like, if it's not for you, it's just not for you. If it was for me, it would have been for me. So I just can't, 
I can't force it, you know? So I'm just like, the interview, when I say it went really, really good, like everybody was intrigued. Uh, we had really good conversations. It was, it was really good. Um, so I know it was like a really hard pick for them and that's fine. Um, like I said, everything happens for a reason and now I'm at this space and where I'm at is really I don't know like I'm just at a place in my life where it, if it's for me it's for me if it's not it's not and that's just where I'm at like I've been like just just like really taking my time with, I've been doing Bible study every single morning just taking my time and just reading the will of God and just like even before like I've always, I've always been a church girl whatever but I never really the one time I tried to read the Bible it was so traumatic for me because I was like what the freak is going on like I was reading the Old Testament so <laughs> yeah I didn't know like you I didn't know so now that I'm like I bought a 40 days book that break down the Bible and just like reading the life that God want for us and just the things he asks from us it's like it's nothing he asks 10 commandments it's not hard like and it's so crazy because I just think about everything I've been through in my life and it's just like I had 10 rules to go by versus the roller coasters, the heartaches, the the disobeyment, the 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 foolishness. The foolishness that that that, that us as humans take our way take take ourselves through versus just obeying and just like just just not caring just not care just not caring how people feel just not caring because everybody gonna have something to say i'm just learning it don't matter what you do how you do it if you're doing good if you're doing bad people gonna have something to say so it's just like i just i just don't care anymore like i i'm just on my path and at the end of the day whatever God see fit for me he's going and whatever he don't see fit for me he's going to take he's going to remove and I'm okay with it like I'm just so okay with it like and I'm just I'm just trying to build a better version like that's all I want to do like and like my next podcast that I'm actually about to drop Sunday is just choose your heart like I'm actually going to edit, edit it later on today choose your heart like everything we do in life is hard so it don't matter what we do it's going to be hard choose which way you want to go we half our life we sin and by the time we realize some people never realize but most of us by the time we realize i don't been through xyz with sin i don't been fighting demons so long i don't been back and forth in god will out of god will this and that this and that what I do know is it don't work. It just don't work. So why not just go in wholeheartedly with God? Like every everything else don't work. It don't work. It's temporary. Everything else is temporary. It don't work. And it always ends badly. Every time. Like every time. It don't ever end good. And we get it mixed up with trials and tribulations because this culture is full of the replacement culture, the 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 culture of non-appreciation, the culture of I can do better, I can move forward, I can do this, I can do that. It's it, it's just the culture of disgust, like ugh, like it, you know, like it's just. And I'm just at the point where I'm just, I don't want to deal with, nobody that don't want to deal with me. I just don't want to deal with people that's not for me. And the, I just want to deal with my tribe and the people that God sent that's for me. And anything that's not for me, I just don't want it around. 
I will only want people around me that understand me, that that gets me, that want to get me, that just that just want me to be me and know my heart. Like you know what I'm saying, like, and and that's just what's important to me right now. Like, and I'm just all in. Like, I'm just all in. Like. And it's just like God just wants so much good for us. Like, oh my God, that's all, that literally every part of the Bible I read. Like, He just let us do foolishness, and then at the end, He just be like, "I love you anyway. I just want you to be better. I just want good for you. I want you to have fulfilled life. I want you to have my unconditional love. I want you to have um everything you want. I want you to like literally as soon as we done with foolishness, He just be like." I'm going to give you this. I want you to have that. I want you like, like just begging us and we just long, longing for nothing, like things that's not going to last long when we can just last long with him and just believe in him and have the faith in him. Like, so that's what I'm doing. I'm going to finish this certificate. I'm going to work. I'm going to start on the other one. Um, a few weeks after that, I'm gonna work on my resume. I'm gonna work on the things I need to work on. I'm gonna study YouTube University, like, <laughs> and I'm gonna just let God lead me. And um, that's where I'm at right now. I'm still on my podcast. I'm still gonna still work on my graphic design. I'm, I'm never gonna stop that dream. I'm just a creator, and that's just what I love to do. And my clients, my target audience will find me. Um, God will send them. Um, my podcast will grow as I grow. And, and it, it just all going to come together. And it's just going to be one big, beautiful um, caterpillar that just turned into one big butterfly. <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little update vlog or whatever. Like I said, 10%. I'm not going to do too much, but... Yeah, like, I'll see you guys in my next vlog.